My research is focused on the stem cells in the adult brain. My research focuses on the transition between stable tumors and metastasis. You want to see how the immune system interacts with, uh, with the body when, it's, uh, when it has cancer. What I'm mostly interested in is the metastatic process, which is the um, kind of the end stage of, of uh, primary tumor progression. One of the things that we're trying to study in the lab is understanding the roles of regulatory RNAs. Where we're trying to figure out how cells know where they are in the body. For instance, why this type of skin on the palm of your hand doesn't grow hair, but if you just flip it over, there's a very different type of skin that does grow hair. I kind of say it a little jokingly to my husband, but I'm like, I'm going to go cure cancer today. <laughs> My own mother passed away from cancer. My father had prostate cancer and passed away four years ago. One of my very close colleagues, his mother passed away. <laughs> I lost my mother to cancer. So finally being in a situation where I can answer questions that then impact something that has impacted me in my life makes a huge difference because it's personal. Damon Runyon is a phenomenal opportunity for, for young scientists. Many of the ideas what Damon Runyon funds, they are risky, such as my project. You know, it, uh, when you begin, it's very difficult to get funded. The money that's funneled through this program really gets to you know, innovation and discovery. We're seeing a lot of Nobel Prizes going to very young scientists nowadays. So the proof is in the pudding there. The unique perspective young people bring is this, nothing's impossible, I can change the world. This is work I need to do today in order to help people tomorrow and not a week from now, not a year from now or 10 years from now.